was nothing. Alright then, test number four. And now, getting tired of all these tests yet? Well, they are necessary. I might never even upload any of these. This is just for myself. Might have noticed an issue where at certain moments, the game kind of like cuts out a full second of the video. I noticed it too, and it was disturbing me. Like, actually disturbing me, like, giving me precognitive nightmares, so... I did some digging online, and I found what is supposedly a solution. Too much processing power, so I switched off two specific settings. And they should fix the issue. Some people have accused me of being negative, only criticizing, not offering solutions when it comes to Spider-Man. Jameson, Here's the real Mr. Negative. negative. Very simple. Unmask. Join the police academy. Wear a badge. Then you can catch all the crooks you want, and I'll sing your praises on this very show. And all that hogwash about how that would place his loved ones in danger? Come on! You can't convince me that guy has any loved ones! That's just sad. I'm glad someone finally pointed out that Jameson said, hey, the reason we wears a mask is because he has loved ones. But Jameson's response is just, oh, come on. No one can believe he actually has loved ones. I'm like, okay, that's kind of cold, Jameson. Obviously he has loved ones. Again, I feel like there's some sort of ulterior guys, guys. motive. Guns to the face is not proper consumer etiquette. Oh, that guy won't be in one kick. That. that guy's just standing there. Oh, thought you got me there. Is that it? Nope, there's these guys. It's like this whole thing was just an ambush for Spidey. Well, I say thee nay, fool. Anyone left? Gotta be a special kind of crazy to rob a storefront in the city Spider-Man protects. <laughs> now, I noticed with the uh, the lag issue, um, not not the lag issue, the the thing where the video just randomly skips a second. It doesn't always happen immediately. So I'm gonna make this video mm, at least ten minutes long, uh, just just to make sure everything works. Which is a shame, because I've already recorded two other 10-minute videos today. Well, 10-minute-plus videos today. So, uh... Yeah. Sadly, I might just delete them. Actually, no. I'll keep them as, uh... I'll keep them as, uh, testing... ...records. Yep, it's a car chase. There sure are a lot of car chases. In New York, that's almost a death sentence. They always manage to hit me when I'm in the air. I can never. I can never get that bonus for for beating them without getting hit. Oh, there were only two of them. Jeez. Hello, Mr. Rat. What? Again. This makes no sense. Why is why are there more of them? I thought it was just the two of them. I didn't realize every crime had an army that came with it. Well, that did nothing. That's why I think you were weapons. Yeah. Okay, I know I hit dodge. So that's it, huh? I've had worse commutes. Feel free to run over his hands if you want. No, I'm just kidding. But seriously, though. It's kind of ridiculous how much damage they do. I think they actually do more damage than Kingpin in his fight. Spidey, 
At least on amazing difficulty. No, I'm serious. It actually seems like those thug guys do more damage with a single punch than Kingpin does. It's kind of ridiculous. Although also kind of sad because Kingpin's basically just a bigger version of them. I hate that when a boss is basically just a bigger version of a regular enemy. It's kind of lazy, to be honest. Bosses should feel unique. Especially Kingpin, since he's supposed to be smart. I mean, Spider-Man had been fighting the guy for like eight years. And, w and in the beginning of the game, when he like smashes up his turns, he's like, How is this happening? And I'm like, dude been fighting this guy for eight years. You shouldn't be surprised at this point. You should be like, I expected you to do that and stuff. He should be like the criminal mastermind genius. He should basically be like, I don't know, Lex Luthor. If he was like 350 pounds. Like 200 pounds heavier. Thicker. And you're thick! So, one thing I do wish they had in this game, the option to redo the uh, research station missions. Those were fun. I'm glad they had that. They had fun side missions. Yeah, you, you gotta have a lot of fun missions in the game, where each mission feels rather unique. That's a good Spider-Man game. That's what Spider-Man 2 had. We had we had the part, uh, well, Rhino, uh, I don't know if I should count Rhino. Okay, look at this line of school buses. Must be the ones the Joker uses in the beginning of the Dark Knight. Before you say anything, I'm pretty sure the Dark Knight was set... I mean, uh... I'm pretty sure Gotham City is basically meant to be the DC Universe's version of New York City. It certainly feels like it. They're on the roof, aren't they? What's up, fools? Fellas, you can't keep ducking income tax like this. And Sodzy beating. All right, one for you. Now one for me. There's only one of these brute guys. No, nope. there's always two. They're like the hunters from Halo. They come in pairs. I can just imagine what it'd be like if there was if it. There's just one fight where there's nothing but the brutes. Brutes. Enemy from Halo. Hey there. I'll give you a chance to walk away. And you wasted it. Seriously, I feel like that moves a little too Fist brutal. Did keep for these Spidey. wannabe pushers in check. Wait, a, what's that feeling? Do I miss him? No. Sad thing is, Fist was kind of Gotta right. Split before the cops get here. The cops get here. They're going to climb the roof within like a minute, is what Spidey's guessing. And yeah, I know. Helicopters. How many helicopters do you see throughout this city? I will say this though, that is a beautiful sunset. I want to get closer. But let me guess, within the next 10 seconds, another crime is going to pop up. I feel like... Even in real life, there isn't this much crime in New York City. I feel like just Spider-Man's mere existence alone in the city would deter most crime. Like All Might in My Hero Academia. His mere presence, his mere existence deters like 90% of all crimes in like a hundred mile radius. I mean, he's basically like Superman done right. I know, one of the core characteristics of Superman is like, he's basically a, a god playing human. Well, except, you know, he was raised as a human. He's a god raised as a human. It's basically Superman's ideology, or concept design in a nutshell. God raised as a human, so he's very down to earth. I mean... My favorite version of Superman is probably the one from Justice League, and... Probably certain comics. I definitely don't like the one from Man of Steel. It just... It just seems emotionless, you know? It's like he's trying to be Batman or something. All units, 1010 narcotic sale reported in progress. Location is Hudson Town. Good old narcotics. Oh, see, there's one helicopter. Uh, gonna swan dive into the, the water now, so, uh... Wish me luck!